Modeling fractions. Let's review what we know about fractions from our work with decimals. One tenth can look like this. One over ten or zero point one one tenth. As long as you have ten equals equal pieces, you have tenths. One hundredth can look like this. That would be one hundredth, one over hundred, or point oh one is one hundredth. But let's talk about other fractions we'll see in everyday life. This would be half of a candy bar, a third of a candy bar would be this much, one-fourth, one-fifth, or even one-eighth of a candy bar. Fraction models show part of a whole, so you can draw a picture. What part of the bar is shaded? Well, five out of seven parts are shaded, so five are shaded out of a total of seven, we would say five-sevenths is shaded. Name the fraction being modeled. We have five sections, so that's your denominator, the number on the bottom, and your numerator, the number on the top, would be how many are shaded, so one-fifth. There are eight sections, three of which are shaded, so three-eighths. Now draw your own model by shading fifths. Fifths are a little hard to draw, so you just have to estimate them. So five equal sections, and shade in two out of the five. For fourths, on a circle, always put a dot in the middle first, will help you be a little more even. And one, two, three out of the four would be shaded. You can also round fractions to the nearest half unit, to zero, half, or one. What you need to do is compare the numerator and the denominator to see. Round to zero if the numerator is much smaller than the denominator like 1 out of 10, 7 out of 50, 11 out of 100, would round to 0. 1 half, if the numerator is about half of the denominator, 4 out of 10, 24 out of 50, or 52 out of 100. So in this example, 4 out of 10, 4 tenths would round to a half. Round to 1, if the numerator and the denominator are about the same. 9 out of 10 would run round to 1, or 45, 48 out of 50, 96 out of 100. So let's try it. Round each fraction to 0, half, or 1. 43 out of 50, that gives you almost the whole thing, so we would say is about 1. 93 out of 100 is about 1. But 3 out of 20, half of 20 would be 10, so this would be closer to 0.